A pair of local wine experts are moving their way up the ranks. They recently reached advanced sommelier status. Fox 2's Mike Colombo uncorks the story of their success. We should add like 40 skis of Greek wine. Sitting, sipping, studying. For Alicia Blackwell Calvert and Anthony Geary, wine is their work and their hard work recently landed them advanced sommelier status from the Court of Master Sommeliers. The advanced sommelier examination is three parts. So there is a theory examination, and if you pass the theory examination, you get invited to take the service exam and the tasting examination. It's just like training for a marathon or any, any sort of any sort of study where it's almost this like religious commitment to the task. Alicia and Anthony started studying in February. They passed the theory exam in May, and in October they took the service and tasting test. Presentation, decanting a bottle, um, doing champagne service. Um, can you pour a Calvados? Can you make a cocktail? Can you make four cocktails? Can you do beer service? Do you know your vintages for port? It's very easy to kind of throw up your hands in this whole process and say, I'm done, I just want to go back to watching movies when I get off work and um, I want to drink, you know, some bush light from time to time. Um, but having another person definitely really helps. 225 candidates took the exam. Of the 31 who passed, Alicia and Anthony were the only Missourians this year. The pair, who make up two-thirds of the sommelier team at the Cinder House restaurant inside the Four Seasons Hotel St. Louis, now wear these prestigious pins as a sign of their certification. You want that authority. It's like, I've earned this. I've earned the right to be here. No one can take that away from me. Alicia hopes her professional accomplishments will keep the door open for other women of color to enter the world of wine. People take their stereotypes um, that they have in their head when they look at me and then um, think I'll perform a certain way or or recommend a certain bottle because of the way I look. It's part of who I am. I, I do enjoy being on this journey that a lot of people haven't traveled already. I like to be a part of that. And I'm proud of who I am and what I represent. With two local experts at the ready, we wanted to know where they'd recommend someone new to wine start their journey in this new year. I would recommend Italy. I think Italy is a great place. I think Sangiovese is a, it's a great grape. It's diverse and you can pick up a great bottle of Chianti for 10 to 15 bucks still. I'd say start with Pinot Noir. It's soft, lighthearted, uh, velvety textured. Um, it's definitely not offensive, so I would start there. And if their bubbling passion for their profession ignited your thirst to learn more, set foot into Cinder House to be wined and dined. I'm Mike Colombo, Fox 2 News.